Since 2011, the Indiana Stellar Communities Program has helped fund revitalization projects in communities with federal money. Most recently in our area, Wabash won Stellar Funds. Now the whole of East Allen County is going to go for that prize. News Channel 15's Kelly Roberts explains the new opportunity that has opened up for the region. Kelly. Brighton Heather, for seven years, the Stellar Program has awarded money to just one community. But this year, it opened the money up to regions, meaning two or more communities teaming up. East Allen County quickly jumped at that shot. Since 1991, the New Allen Alliance has worked with stakeholders in East Allen County, from New Haven to Monroeville to Woodburn, to build the community up. For four years, the organization has been working on a strategic planning process for every area of the county. Quality of life, quality of place. We're wanting to make sure that we have investment in our communities for generations to come. So in February, when New Allen Alliance found out the Stellar Program would award money to regions, it felt it already had a lot of work done. I think our chances are pretty good, given that we've already worked together for quite some time to create these plans. The group will send a letter of interest to the state next month. Then in August, final plans will be turned in. The group wants to focus on things like downtowns, parks, and streetlights and sidewalks. The individual communities have some work to do before the final plans are turned in. I think the biggest thing is just being committed to um, developing the projects that they have presented uh, in a manner that they really understand the scope and you know what they're getting into. One project the region hopes to see benefited by the Stellar program is the Cedar Creek Parks Trail in Leo. Which is going to bring that connectivity of six parks together from Matea County Park all the way through to Leo, Cedarville, Grable. Two winners will be picked in November. The total package could be up to 25 to 30 million dollars in funds. Kelly Roberts, News Channel 15.